Welcome to the VMware Cloud Verified Application Process. Today, we will be walking you through the step-by-step -step process of how to complete a VMware Cloud Verified Application. Please remember that in order to begin this process, you must be a VMware Cloud Provider Partner in good standing with a contract level above 360 points. You can contact Cloud Verified Badge at VMware.com if you have any questions at all while navigating through this process. To begin the Cloud Verified process, please go to the link at the top of this slide. Next, you will click on the Apply Now button that is located about halfway down your page. Then, you will log in to VMware Partner Connect using your secure partner login. If you do not know your username or password, please contact VMware Partner Connect by using the email us link at the bottom of the slide. Now, you need to create your partner profile if you do not already have one. If you've created a partner profile, check it one more time to make sure it looks good. Remember, this is what a potential customer will see when they are deciding if they should choose you as a company they wanna work with in the future. So make this look great. If your profile looks good, then you are now ready to apply for validation. You will select the blue button to begin this process. I've also included a sample profile here to show you what we would like for your profile to look like before a potential customer sees it. The more information you have here and the nicer you can make this profile page look, the better your chances are of a potential customer choosing to use your services. To create a profile, you just need to enter your basic company details. The more details you can add here, the better. You don't have to offer a free trial, but it can only help you in the long run when a potential customer is deciding if they wanna work with you or not. The same thing goes for social media. This isn't a required field, but the more details you can add on this page, the better. You can add all of your compliance and certifications. We have many items to select here, such as cloud security, SAP hosting partner, and Sarbanes-Oxley. You'll want to add the provider services that you offer as well. There are a number of these, including application managed services, cloud consulting services, disaster recovery as a service, and many, many more. You'll also want to add in all of your vertical markets. These can include education, financial services, and healthcare, to name just a few. You'll want to give your potential customers the opportunity to contact an expert. You want to showcase all of your great work to a potential customer, and this is the best way of doing this. Remember, this profile page is your face to the potential customer. You are now ready to apply for validation. If you have already created a profile, you can now apply for validation. Below is a sample of the VMware Cloud Provider Validation Portal homepage. This is your custom dashboard. You can click under Cloud Verified on this blue icon that looks like an eye to apply for validation, to edit your profile, or to add region-specific data centers. This is a screenshot of your personalized dashboard. It will show you which services you have applied for and if your application is active or in review or if you possibly have not met all of the requirements. To apply for Cloud Verified, you must submit screenshots from the usage meter of the required core technologies in the VMware validated solutions. The core technologies include VMware Cloud Director, vSphere, NSX, vSAN, and usage meter. The above screenshots are examples of the vSphere, Cloud Director, and Usage Meter versions that a partner is running. Now that you have submitted your screenshots and your application, you are in the review stage. Our Cloud Verified team will go in and review your documentation to make sure you are running the required technologies in the VMware validated solutions. At that point, our team will either approve or reject your application. You will get an email letting you know that you have been approved or rejected. If you are rejected, we will give you a specific reason of why you were rejected and you can submit your application again. After submitting your VMware validated design documentation, you will receive a similar email to the one on this slide. You are then in the review process, which should take 48 to 72 hours. 
Here, I provided a sample email when you are approved for Cloud Verified. This is the email that you will receive. VMware requires that all Cloud Verified partners revalidate their VMware validated solutions every 18 months. We want to ensure our partners are running the latest and greatest VMware technologies. You will receive an email at 60 days out from revalidation, 30 days out, then on the exact revalidation date. You will have a grace period of 30 days from your revalidation date before VMware delists your profile on our website. To renew your Cloud Verified status, please go to the link that we have listed here. Thank you for your time today. If you get stuck anywhere in this process, please feel free to contact cloudverifiedbadge at vmware.com.